the weird thing is we don't exist in the physical world. We do exist inside of a story that the brain tells itself. Basically, a brain cannot feel anything. A neuron cannot feel anything. They're physical things. Physical systems are unable to experience anything. But it would be very useful for the brain or for the organism to know what it would be like to be a person and to feel something. Yeah. So the brain creates a simulacrum of such a person that it uses to model the interactions of the person. It's the best model of what that brain, this organism, thinks it is in relationship to its environment. So it creates that model. It's a story, a multimedia novel that the brain is continuously writing and updating. Mm. So what we can identify as computer scientists, we can engineer systems and test our theories this way that uh, may have the necessary and sufficient properties to produce the phenomena that we are observing. But I, we both know that the world that you and me are seeing is not the real physical world. What we are seeing is a virtual reality generated in your brain to explain the patterns on your retina. 